is Kohlberg Open Air. Should be a great day because it's sunny out and it's an outdoor gig, so that's one weight off the shoulders. Nothing's gayer than a fucking outdoor event that gets rained out. I'm just gonna try and get a hold of everybody pretty early here. I'm a little unsettled though because I still have not found Billy. He's been outside for two days. Before I head out today, I'm gonna drive to Future Shop and I'm gonna buy my own GPS. Amanda's sister has been kind enough to lend me hers many, many times, but I just don't want to ask anymore. I don't want to keep being like, oh, can I? Can I? Can I borrow your GPS? I'm kind of fucking pissed because I have no clue where that son of a bitch fucking cat is. He always does that now. He just fucks right off blocks away at a time. My mom said if we get him neutered that it, that should stop happening and I'm not, I don't know if that is true. It probably is because you know if someone chopped off my nuts I wouldn't really go anywhere for a while. It's almost 12.30 so the Kohlberg open air has been going on for about an hour now. I just hope we can get there at a decent time, maybe an hour or two before our set starts. At least Fuck, this is gonna be a day. It's gonna be a day, man. Well, this looks like the one. It's gonna be my whole paycheck, but, uh, whatever. How much do you want to fucking bet on a day like today it's gonna be a defective model? Just cause everything I've bought for the past year has been fucked out of the box and caused me like a week and a half of pure aggravation. My camera is, of course, low on batteries, which is perfect for a fucking day like today where we need it to go play a goddamn music festival and shit. Ah, so I better get off it and stop being an idiot and wasting the battery. I've made it to Amanda's and I've honked the horn, so let's see how ready she isn't. Hi, sweetie. Hi. I'm ready. Good. You sound so sick. Amanda's so sick and she's still coming to the show because I'm going to make her. Amanda's just getting her fingers on the GPS right now, getting the... I don't know, the plastic off the front. I, of course, haven't heard from Alex or Sean yet, which is not good. Neither of them have a cell phone, and I called the house they were going to be staying at. And uh, nobody answered, so I'm pretty much guessing that everyone's asleep still. Before any show, I always recommend a recommended dose of NOS. Fuck Monster, fuck Red Bull, fuck Rockstar, fuck Full Throttle, fuck Amp, fuck Rush, fuck Synergy, I don't know whatever the fuck else they sell. All you need is NOS. Right now we're basically on the way to sweat and scream in public. Big time. It's gonna be hot, humid, and fucking dank. Dank as fuck. Dank. <laughs> Aaron's in the back and we got all the fucking gear back there again except for Sean's uh, base rig. He's got that shit and him and Alex are on the way down. They better be, god damn it. I got my GPS, everything's fine. We just need to get some food into this. Sicky head. Sicky head. <laughs> I bet you that toilet paper considers itself pretty lucky. Now that we're, you know, on the way and things are going well, we've run into that you cock sucker. Right. Yeah, you get out of here, faggot. Scram, you fuck. Or was it someone else? Because someone seems to be going like 30 There's clicks. There's another person that's slow in front of them. Son of a fuck. You damn right, you get out of here, you Yeah, you cock. get out of here, you hay cock sucker, with oh, your fucking. Yeah, hay hurdling. Hootin' <laughs> Annie. Now move it! Like, what the fuck? There's another one. Why is there a grouping of slow moving vehicles in farm country? I am starving and I'm sick and I hate long drives. Long drives aren't so bad. It's not like it's physically aggravating or anything. I know. But I'm sick and this sucks and I'm hungry. And I don't know when we're gonna when be there. When you first said you were sick, I thought you were talking about like puke sick. I was like, this will be a fun drive then. Great. <laughs> I wouldn't go anywhere if I was puking sick. It's always a bad idea. Uh, well, we're just driving along and Max's ABS comes on and we smash it at this truck. Wow. Well, this is a fun situation. <laughs> like I just fixed the van, now I gotta fix the truck. Uh, I think that's his muffler. <laughs> oh man, like literally my my ABS come on, comes on 
uh, in weather like this. This is what I apparently slid on. And I bumped into him and like I bent his muffler up a bit. So we exchanged information. Man, did I ever just have an excellent situation. Yeah, yeah I, uh, I rear-ended somebody at about, I don't know, eight kilometers an hour. And of course there's a cop right there to be like, oh, Jesus. let's do paperwork. And I guess I'm on gear guard like usual. Are you hot? Yeah. Are you kidding me? Holy, holy base. And our first song is called Escape. Who are you? Who will you be? Every part of your living day is misplaced. When you will get in, your life is born. There is no turning back. You are now born of them. I come. Like, yes, thank you, GPS. It's all like you have reached your destination. And then I hit a guy in a truck at about four kilometers an hour. It was a pimp truck, though, so yeah. it basically folded like paper.
Lex, the set was really good, but the cops came right after the set and said there's been noise complaints and the, the local people don't like the content that they're hearing, but it's a music stage for concerts. I don't know. They're just they're like, turn it down or stop swearing or like, I don't know. The guy who set up the show uh, paid to have this stage, so music. Too bad if they don't like it. And there's park security, like, oh, too loud. It's pancake nipples. <laughs> oh, I don't know, dude. This is pretty nasty. 100,000. We finished the show, and it was a decent crowd, but the, the heat wasn't decent. I'll tell you that much. Heat was indecent. We had an old man come up and voice his opinion, so I voiced mine, and he was like, um, excuse me, I'd like to have a word with you, and it's like, yeah, you're dumb. He liked Alex, though. He was like, yeah, give me your phone number. Pretty much, it's my groupie. Right now we got into exile on and the fucking cops are coming by with noise complaints. Like I'm pretty sure it's a outdoor theater. It's way before 11 like p.m. And like the bill's been paid, so fuck off, basically. Yay, Lake Ontario for giving us something to drink after an intensely hot show. Don't, don't, no, we're not no. going in there. No, we're going in there. No, we're not. Is it cold? I'm gonna fucking tell my Oh man, <laughs> maybe if I get mutated, I'll become a better uh, bass player. <laughs> maybe. Six fingers, be like, oh. Like, fuck uh, you all. That's an epic lake. We're on the way home now. Aaron, Sean, and Alex stuck around uh, the show just to check it out, watch it, and shit. Uh, I took off because I'm going to go visit with my father and my uncle, and Amanda's feeling very ill still. Thank you for coming, sweetie, and filming and being a good sport. It was a good show beyond the uh, little bit of a bumper ding and the fine. And the noise complaints, like, oh no, the noise complaints, like it's broad fucking daylight in a public park. Suck me the fuck off, basically. Then the cops come just to be like, oh well, uh, we have all these noise complaints, and then Aaron Simmons is like, uh-huh. <laughs> but it was great to have, uh, see the fans out. There's Brandon that came, and he, I wanted to talk to you after the show, but then you're like, poof, you were gone. Like, I was like, what happened? Thank you one last time to Aaron Simmons. If you don't know who Aaron Simmons is, or if you have him on your Facebook, Ahead, just keep left. just shut up for a minute. Talk it. Go to Facebook. Punch in Aaron Simmons. Whatever. Thank him for fucking hooking up Kohlberg Open Air and having the cops come down on his shit and bust on his ass for no fucking reason. Like it's retarded. We're here at my dad's now, and I'm going in for a well-earned pee. That's for sure. Hey, hey. Cool. It's your criminal son. Nice GPS work in there, sonny. Yeah, it's pretty good. Gotta get some spamming in there. Yeah, I'm on the road, so I gotta use my phone. My throat hurts, and my ears feel really weird. Because I'm sick. My ears are messed up because I'm sick. Well, there you are, you little prick. Yeah, enjoy it. Hey, Bill, it's nice to see you. Fucking asshole. Nice to see you, Bill. Bill. No going outside for you anymore.